I had about four or five or six more slots. Uh, I originally came here to do some poetry tonight, so I'm going to start off with that. Y'all just bear with me. All right, here we go. <clears throat> know what y'all think. If I died tomorrow, I'd still be at your funeral, or my funeral, seeking out a few Negroes, the ones that we usually know, impossible to let go. Filled with justice and no pretend, but wait, because this just ends. From love that comes within, with drinking with all your friends, but we say fuck it because we live YOLO when life just begins. The next day we become friends, and later on I call you Ken. So let's party until the end, grab on, and don't forget that Dooley was all in. For college was the beginning, from boys we turn men, and girls that make us fin to get money to support kids. And Scotty, who ain't shit, and Mark, who's on 10. And Ashley, where to begin, from Wendy's to what's this? And her, she knows her from more precious than God's earth to my bro, my all worth, and cousin who's just a jerk. Goddamn, I hate to love you, but all we all suffer. And Lord, make no mistakes as I pray his hands touch us. It's a little poem I did right there. I only came for the porch tonight, but I might as well freestyle out some comedy. Um, how many of y'all get y'all car service at Firestone? Nobody in here? Okay, so uh, we don't know about the Firestone account. Basically, what the Firestone account is, uh, is credit. You see, I see the look on some of y'all faces when I say credit. So, uh, it, it, you know, after I say credit as I'm talking to a customer, they face just look like they've been catfished. Straight up. Um, <laughs> so I'm, I'm usually on the outside looking in, but now I work there, so I'm on the inside looking out. And a customer comes in today, and you know they come in for that basic oil changes, uh, standard wheel alignments, and tire rotation. So a customer comes in, and uh, he asks for a CBI, which is a complete vehicle inspection. Now this gives you the rundown on everything about your car. So after I get that ticket back, I tell you exactly what's wrong with your car and what you need. You know, um, so I get the ticket back and I price everything up. This guy needs brakes, pads, rotors, all sorts of shit. So his ticket is somewhere around 1800 bucks. And uh, I, I tell him, sir, uh, this is exactly what you need. And it's going to run you about 1800 bucks. And you know, his first impression was, ah. So with this Firestone account, you get like 10% off of your services or whatever. I tell him about it. I'm like, sir, you can sign up for this if this is something you want to do. You know, with the catfish face look, you know, it came with a couple of symptoms. So this guy, he's, uh, he's looking at me and I'm telling him, whether you get the credit or not, um, I still give you 20% off on all, off all, all your purchases or whatever. He's standing over here and, uh, you know, I suck at him in with the 20%. But at the same time, you know, he got that first symptom. It was like, oh, I got to go boo-boo real good. <laughs> you know, you put your hand over the counter, and it's just like, ah. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? He's just looking up at me, and I'm looking at him like, look, man, in my head, my credit ain't no better than yours. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, uh, he's like, all right, let's just do it. And I'm like, okay, cool. So I get all this information in. And next comes your social security and your annual income. He has to put that in. You know, symptom number two, <laughs> he's like, no, 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 I shouldn't. I, I, I shouldn't. I'm like, sir, um, if you're going to sign up for it, you got to enter it. Now, I can't see it, and I'm telling him to go ahead and do it. And, he, you know, he types it all in or whatever. Being me, I got to be cool, come and collect it. This is my job, for crying out loud. And I don't want to be the person to tell somebody that, look, your credit is shitty. There's no way you can pay for this. <laughs> you know what I mean? So he puts it in and, and it gets not approved. You know, and in my mind, I'm like, damn. <laughs> so, you know, I, I, I force myself to step back and just take a deep breath like, uh, uh, sir. You know, me being quiet just kept him like, uh, you, you know, it, it didn't get approved. So, uh, I mean, I can still get you that 20% off. He gets mad at me. It is your fault. You you did this to me. No, I I didn't even ask for this. And I'm like, sir, calm down. Then this is my job on the daily. <laughs> I'm getting pissed by now because I'm like, I'm trying to help you by giving you 20% off whether you got the, the card or not. 
in my mind, I'm thinking to myself, I should just reach over here and slap some hair on your damn head. <laughs> the hell, I'm trying to help you, and this is how you disrespect me. This guy's over here, he's just going ape shit. And you know, I, and I'm not, I'm not racist or anything. I don't even like to talk about race. But he was, uh, I want to say Indian or Pakistani, I'm not sure. <laughs> so he gets mad at me. And I had to escort him out the door, like, look, sir, just, you got to leave, because now you're getting too angry, and he starts slapping shit all over the place. And I'm like, what? Well, fuck me. You know what I mean? So I'm like, Pakistan, Jujakistan, all I know is you can pack and stand your ass on that corner, but you ain't going to get this damn car today. Now, I hate that for you. And I, I work at the Firestone over in Apple Valley, so uh, last week, I don't know if you guys heard, but... Uh, it, it was at gunpoint over some chicken nuggets at McDonald's. Did you hear about that? <laughs> exactly, the same damn thing. Now, first thing came to my mind when I heard it was at gunpoint over some damn chicken nuggets was, that motherfucker, is, his weed is better than mine, obviously. <laughs> I mean, over some chicken nuggets? Damn, I mean, can you imagine how that went? Uh, yeah, I like to get another uh, number 10. And let me get some sweet and sour sauce in there. And don't forget, let me get a McFurry to praline. All right, thank you. Uh, sir, I'm sorry. Uh, that's our last batch of chicken nuggets. It's going to be at least a 30-minute wait. We just gave it to that guy. That's that what look. What? I come to this motherfucker every goddamn day. I order the same number to She know me. Look at her back there. Jaylene. Girl, you know me, I, I, I even told you, this. I special ordered this, I text messaged you and everything. Had that number 10 ready, S sweet and sour sauce, and this is a goddamn thanks I get. I even dropped quarters and shit in the little feed the children jar. You can't even have my special number 10 order for me. So, so I'm imagining in my head, this guy looks over at the other guy, now you gonna give me them goddamn nuggets right now. And I'm not playing with you, I blow your goddamn head smooth off. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I just went into pinkies mode. This is just my fucked up imagination. That's how I get. You know, and granted, weed does some shit to you. And I'm not saying everybody else go out and smoke it. And don't hate me because mine's is better than yours. But I'm just looking at, I'm just imagining the whole scenario in my head. And this guy's like, uh, dude, I'm not going to give you my nuggets. You know, you can have these if these are the nuggets you want. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, you think I'm fucking playing? Now, everybody, clear out! Goddamn now, and girl, you you take them clothes off because you look good. And then you gonna give me them goddamn nuggets right now. <laughs> and the other guy's just over here, oh shit, dude, come the fuck down, man. Fucking nuggets, are you serious? That, these are ain't even the right. Did you not read the article in last week's Facebook issue one or whatever? Uh, nuggets supposed to have hair in them. I don't give a damn. I waited on this for the fucking number 10 extra sweet and sour sauce, and this is the thanks I get. You're gonna give me them nuggets. I'm gonna blow your ass over. <laughs> Just my own fucked up imagination about this guy and those freaking nuggets, and what to make a person lose their damn mind like that. You know what I mean? Granted, I'm up here and I'm freestyling the whole damn thing. I, I just like to be funny, I'm sorry. Uh, had I known that this was comedy, I would've came prepared. You know what I mean? But I, I, I didn't, and uh, granted, you guys let me get up on this stage and do my thing. Um, follow me on Twitter at uh, QDooley, two times, and that's the number two in X. Follow me, and uh, I like the support. I'm about to start doing this comedy thing. I just graduated college, and I want to see how it work out for me. Thank you, guys. <laughs>